Hey guys, what's up? This is a um, Wildfire Productions on how to um, install um, the Tale of Kingdoms mod. So basically, what we're going to do is we're going to type in percent app data percent. Make sure you type that in. And you're going to click on roaming. Then you're going to click on dot Minecraft. Okay. Don't click on if you have another launcher. Don't click. Don't try and install it into TechKit or anything like that because it won't work. Okay. The next thing you're going to want to do is. Well, I already have it installed, so I'm just going to be replacing it all. But what you want to do is go into the bin. Okay. And yep, let's go into the bin. Come on. Oh wait, wait, we got it. Yep, there we go. Um, then we want to um, open this with a uh, 7-zip or WinRAR, doesn't matter, whatever floats your boat, really. Um, then we are going to want to open the mods with Wins WinZip, preferably, because it's easier to transfer and such. So. What you want to do is make sure you open mod loader first, otherwise this is not going to work. Okay? You need to open mod loader first and put it in. So the first thing you're gonna to need to do is drag all your folders, all your um, classes from the mod loader file straight into your bin. You don't nothing complicated about that. It's just straight in. Okay. Then when you have um, done that, what you are going to want to do is um, make sure, you know, make sure it's all gone in, doesn't gone into a file because this happened to me before. And yes, click yes, obviously, but make sure it doesn't go into a file because this happened to me before in a pre recording. I accidentally put it in a um, um, file, yeah. And also, you want to delete meta inf while there. Um, otherwise it won't work okay now you're done with that you can close this and then you can um, install all of these classes even the file otherwise don't put the file in the mod section I made that mistake before put it in here all in the bin everything from this mod goes in the bin okay and you want to click yes okay and now we want to um, go to Minecraft, open run, yes, and wait a second. And uh, what you need to do is log in, whatever. Yep. Go full screen. Preferably. Otherwise, yeah. Uh, yeah. Let me just pause the video for a second. Yeah, it's been a bit funny. There we go. Um, back and go into single player. Start a new world. I'm gonna put it on creative because I think you get like a powers mode or some something something like that. Yes, creative, come on. <laughs> oh my god, let me click on creative. Uh go on. Yeah, there we go. Um create new world. This will take a while to start up if you haven't got a million dollar computer, because it is a very big mod. Um and we shall be in business in probably another minute or so. Come on. Yep. Anyway, anyway, I'll in this time I will uh, talk about. Um, um, uh, we're going to be doing a let's play Minecraft and maybe a mm, like a Counter Strike let's play, even though that doesn't really involve anything but shooting each other. But still, I'll do Counter Strike because Counter Strike is amazing. Um, and yeah, we. This is pretty much how you install it. Make sure you follow all my steps. Pause the video if you have to, and everything. Let me just. Let's just load up the world now. Here we go. See, the mod has officially worked. 
as you can see I have X charge and uh, it tells me my form and amount of gold coins I have. This is only happens in creative though, seeing that you can not really do anything, it will just be cheating if you can play it the normal way and yeah. It's gonna be a bit laggy because I'm do have um some programs running in the background but oh well. Nevertheless, it still worked, and yeah, this is pretty much the um, end of an episode. Uh, well, not really an episode, this is just pretty much how to install um, Tale of Kingdoms uh, mod. I will be uploading a mod review later tonight or tomorrow, and yeah, peace out. Okay, guys, if you want to see the mod review, click the link, it'll be on the video or in the description, and uh, see you later.